They've done it, people. Simone and Jonathan are one step closer to tying the knot. We can't wait to see Simone walk down the aisle with the love of her life. After all that they've been through, they deserve this happiness and so much more. But like the rest of you, we've been just as curious about how it all came about. Without further ado, let's jump right into it. Hold up, who is this Jonathan Owens? Like many of you, we hadn't heard of Jonathan until now. Don't worry though, because we've done all the investigative journalism about this athlete just for you guys. First off, Jonathan is a real cutie. A quick scroll down his Instagram Instagram account will prove that. He's mainly posted football-related pictures, but most of his account is about Simone. We love a man who knows how to appreciate the love of his life. What more can you ask for when a man's devoted to you? If you're not a football fan, you probably don't know that Jonathan plays for the Houston Texans team. He's been a part of this team for almost three years now, but that's not all. Owen started his football career back in 2018 and is very passionate about football. He played it religiously in high school and in college. Speaking of college, here's a fact that surprised us. His major in college was pre-physical therapy. Damn, he's got both the brains and the bronze. Another thing about Jonathan that'll make your heart go all aww is that he's pretty family-oriented. He spoke about how his sister was his inspiration for taking football seriously. This handsome hunk is extremely close to all of his family members and posts appreciation messages for them on his Instagram regularly. And did we mention he has a dog named Zeus? This man is full of green flags. So, how did it all begin? It's a pandemic love story. These two lovebirds really did find each other during a time of peak crisis. They connected with each other through the dating app Raya right before the pandemic hit. And from then on, it's been the sweetest story. How could they not bond with each other instantly when they're both so similar? With both of them being athletes, they understand the pressure that comes with having your entire life dedicated to a sport. They both know what it feels like to live under the spotlight, to have the public eye on your every move. We think they find sweet comfort in each other and how they're able to be there for one another. What's even more adorable is how they're both dog lovers. Jonathan mentioned how much his bulldog Zeus loved Simone, and when he figured out Zeus had grown attached to the love of his life, he knew she was the one. What made them click? Yeah, yeah, they found each other on a dating app and ended up creating a forever for themselves. Some of you might have a hard time believing that, considering how exhausting it is to build a true connection through a dating app. But if there's one thing you should believe, it's this. Theirs isn't merely a story of good luck. It's about how you work to build a strong foundation with your partner. They were lucky, however, that they found each other right before the pandemic. Jonathan told her how he had no idea Simone was a world-class athlete. How can anyone not know about our gold medalist? We know, right? It's a shocker, really. Simone, though, loved that he had no idea. When you've spent most of your life under the spotlight, it makes sense to feel relief when people don't know you. You feel like you've been given a clean slate to make an impression without the other person already having a million opinions about you. Right before lockdown made lives miserable for all of us, Jonathan and Simone started hanging out together. And boy, they spent a lot lot of time together. Jonathan mentioned how eventually his house didn't feel like home unless Simone was there. Simone herself felt like she was being herself for the first time in her life, away from all the undue pressure and away from the public eye. She did things she hadn't done before and was having the time of her life. And that is exactly how it should be. We're so happy for the adorable couple. When did they make it official? We have no idea exactly when they made it official, but the first time Simone posted a picture of them together was in August of 2020. Of course, we knew they'd been dating each other before that, but we're glad they took the time in letting the world know they've been seeing each other. She posted a picture of them together with Owens hugging her from behind. You can see the happiness in their eyes is very much real. Jonathan followed suit a month later. In September 2020, he posted a mirror selfie of them. He's hugging her and she's looking right into the mirror, flashing us that brilliant and beautiful smile. They're so perfect for each other. How do they spend their time together? The couple is smitten with each other and they're not afraid to show it. They make sure to spend every single holiday together, whether it's Christmas or New Year's, they find a way to be together. Have you seen how adorable they look wearing matching pajamas for Christmas? That is what we call true festive spirit. Back in March 2021, the two went to Belize to celebrate their one-year anniversary. Simone posted a picture of them together, confessing in her caption that she loves Owens more than Belize. Who wouldn't want a love like that? They're both incredibly supportive of each other. Simone's been spotted at multiple matches supporting Jonathan. She's always there to cheer him on, and he's returned the favor too and stood by her when she withdrew due to mental health concerns. A match made in heaven indeed. And now, they're engaged. After being together for almost two years, they got engaged back in February on Valentine's Day. This really is straight out of a movie, we're telling you. Both shared pictures of their engagement on their Instagram accounts. They're standing inside a beautiful gazebo with the light illuminating the smiles on their faces. Whoever took those pictures captured all the right moments. You can see how happy they feel with each other. We hope their marriage brings even more 
more happiness for the duo. What's the news about the wedding plans? Simone has confirmed that the wedding's going to be next year. Neither of them has confirmed a wedding date yet because they're both busy with wedding planning. Jonathan has his football career to focus on as well, so it's likely the wedding ceremony will be in 2023 during the offseason. They've shared how it's going to be a small private ceremony with close friends and family who witnessed the growth of their relationship. Simone's already picked her dress for the day when she went shopping at Galia La Havre in Los Angeles. We'll see it once she walks down the aisle next year. It's going to be a beach wedding, and we're super excited imagining how absolutely lovely she's going to look in that dress. We've gushed about these lovebirds so much, so let's talk about some other related things that might interest you. Simone opens up about her struggles with mental health. We know Simone withdrew from the Olympics last year citing mental health issues as her reason. Ever since then, she's been open about the mental health struggles athletes in the spotlight have to face. She opened up about what she went through this Wednesday at the Work Human Live conference in Atlanta. She shared how the media had started scrutinizing her and speculating about her life. The legendary star also discussed the effects of the pandemic on the mental health of athletes. It set a precedent because she was the first to come forward so bravely about her struggles. Many other athletes applaud her for her courage and determination. Simone talks about how she's been looking after herself since then and being there for herself because there's more to life than medals and the spotlight. Simone's collaboration with Subway Did you have any idea that Simone's gotten Subway to name a sandwich after her? If you didn't, then we're telling you right now. It's called the Vault Witch, and Simone even tweeted about it. She's seen holding a newer version of the Baja Steak and Jag sandwich. Asking fans to order this sandwich, she mentioned some of them might even get a surprise upon receiving their order. We wonder what it could be. An upcoming movie about the mental health struggles of athletes. Speaking of athletes and their mental health struggles, there's a new movie coming out by director Daryl Roberts, a renowned filmmaker from Chicago. In an interview, Roberts mentioned how it broke his heart to hear Olympic champion Sidney McLaughlin admit that she doesn't want fame. She just wants to be respected. Taking this as inspiration, Roberts now sets out to document the different mental health struggles most athletes face. Taking this as inspiration, Roberts now sets out to document the different mental health struggles most athletes face and shed light on this issue so people can empathize with the athletes. That's a wrap for this video. Have any questions about Simone and Jonathan? Let us know in the comments below. Make sure to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. See you in the next one.